Hi, I'm Brett Walker, and welcome to another installment of Can You Juice It? Everybody in America loves fast food. You can't get much faster than in a convenience store. It's in the title, convenience store. But today we're at our local 7-Eleven, and we're going to get three things for our Can You Juice It project. First, we're going to start off with the Slurpee. Now, the Slurpee is the cornerstone of every good American diet. I like the wild cherry myself. Draws a little spoon on the end. I never could figure out what the spoon was for, but I'll go with it. Every meal must include some sort of meat. Today we're going to have the Bahama Mama. The Bahama Mama is sort of weirdly named because it's really a German sausage and not from Bahama at all. But it's a nice big meaty piece of sausage and it comes in a nice big bun too. One Bahama Mama please. Finally, we come to the dessert. Ever since the Simpsons movie, 7-Eleven has offered these fine Homer Simpson style donuts. I think I'll help myself for one. That's all we need. Now we're just going to go home and juice it up. So we have everything that we need for our juice experiment. We have the Bahama Mama. It is a juicy German sausage, or salchicha alemania, if you're Spanish. We have the Slurpee. And we have the donut, because you have to have dessert. So we're ready to start. We're going to start with the Bahama Mama. What's nice about the Bahama Mama is it's already a size that will fit right into the juicer. Safety first. out of the Bahama Mama than we did out of the Big Mac. Now it's time for the donut. The donut's a little bit big. We're going to have to break it in half first. Remember, safety first. Again, we got a lot more juice out of the donut than we did with the french fries from last time. Now it's time for the Slurpee. Now again, with the Slurpee we can just pour it in. Actually, this is going to be a little bit hard, so we might have to... Ah! Now I know what the spoon is for.
certainly got a lot of juice out of this one, although not quite as much as the Big Mac meal. Now, something that somebody did ask me was, what is in the bin after we're done? Well, I'm going to show you. This bin catches pretty much everything that doesn't get juiced. And as you can see, there are bits of donut, Bahama Mama, and Slurpee. Honestly, we probably could have gotten a lot more juice out of the Slurpee. Maybe if it had melted more. And there you have it. We have the Slurpee, the Bahama Mama, and the donut. And that's all there is to it. Well. That's all the time we have for this week. Until next time, and there will be a next time on Can You Juice It? If you like this, subscribe to the channel and you'll be notified when we upload new videos, which we're hoping will be every week. Until then, I'm Brett Walker for Can You Juice It? Mmm. Oh, you gotta try this. Uh, let me stir it up with the spoon. <laughs> Here you go. Here, take oh. this. Mmm. Isn't that delicious? <laughs> <laughs>